<laughs> so you come crawling back, you sack of shit. What is it you crave this time? Knowledge? Power? Or perhaps are you pure of heart, ready to fight only when necessary, using your skills only to protect yourself from evil? Well, if that's true, then this is the YouTube video for you! Ladies and gents, welcome to my Lethality Caitlyn Guide, in which I will teach you... Self-Defense! Now guys, I have a confession to make. I'm a pacifist. This means that I do not like conflict. But unfortunately, in today's world, people like me don't have a choice. Recently, it seems like the amount of danger in the world is rising at a rapid rate. Some champions do a million damage, some champions take no damage, and worst of all, for the first time, people are really mean in League of Legends. But worry not, guys. Because today, with Lethality Caitlyn, I will teach you how to survive in this scary new world with the power of... Self-Defense! Now, let's take a look at the character. Now, to teach this lesson in... Self-defense! I've picked the character Caitlyn, on whom I shall be building lethality. Her passive makes her shoot bullet, her Q makes her shoot bullet, her W makes her shoot trap, her E makes her shoot net, and her ult makes her shoot bullet. These are the runes I use, pretty sick, I know. Now you might be thinking, hey Nithin, why build lethality? To which I say, bitch I do what I want, lesson one. Self-defense lesson one. The use of self-defense. Guys, before I get too deep into this video, I just want to make it absolutely clear that the techniques I'm going to show you today are exclusively for... What the fuck? Where'd the logo go? Self-defense! Thou must not strike unless stricken first. This is the main principle of self-defense. And to those who break this rule, I curse you to turn into an ugly frog! Not even one of the better looking frogs! Now you see this guy? Notice his cruel intentions when he attacks me. He hopes to take my life, so in response, I take his instead. Now yes, I know, technically, killing that guy does go against my moral code of pacifism. However, he attacked me first, okay? If someone else initiates the conflict, then as an American, it's up to me to bring it to a resolution, because if I don't assess and neutralize this threat, then my very life could be in danger. For I am but a weak and defenseless character who is surrounded by dangerous villains who want to kill me, and I, for one, will not give them the satisfaction. Self-DEFENDED! Now one very common self-defense scenario is when an enemy tries to tower dive you. Now when this happens, it's important to keep your wits about you and react smartly by killing him instead. Now imagine a different scenario though, where this time the enemy tries to tower dive you. What you do here is you just kill him instead, it's easy. But not every enemy is gonna try to tower dive you. Some enemies are pretty smart and will retreat to safety, in which case you should probably just take the guy trying to tower dive you and kill him instead. But in the case of an enemy trying to tower dive you though, if I'm being completely honest, you should probably just try to kill him instead. Now I know what you're thinking, hey Nathan, what do we we do, though, when an enemy tries to tower dive you? Well, personally, if you're asking me, I just kill him instead. I cannot stress that enough. Hey, Ribbon, you tower dive me earlier? Well, guess what? That makes you a threat, okay? Now I have no choice but to defend myself from danger. I'm sorry, but I can't afford to let you live because I'm a very weak character. Oh, Master Yi, you think you can- you think you can make a mockery of me in a public forum? You think you can face a master of self-defense? Well, I guess it was worth a shot. Now, when practicing self-defense as Caitlyn, you're mainly going to want to use your W and your E. You use your W to trap your enemies and your E to slow and escape from them. Then you use your other moves to eliminate the threat. Now, you can also watch an episode of Drake and Josh in the background as I'm doing right here, but that's not entirely necessary. You'll be just fine without it. Really? Galio and Master Yi? Well, it's a good thing that I'm trained in self-defense, because fellas, I don't tolerate violence, okay? Get out of my sight. Or, as a pacifist would say, peace, because it's their favorite vegetable. See, this is what I hate. You got a million people trying to kill me, an innocent, defenseless guy, and it's just ridiculous. What did I do to deserve this? Look, he's still after me. All right, don't worry, I'll handle this. Yorick, maybe instead of attacking me, you should be busy going to the doctor, because you need... A shot! You know, nowadays you gotta stay vigilant, because you never know when you're gonna find something dangerous, because danger can be around any corner. So if you guys see anything dangerous, please go ahead and tell me. Uh, please just notify me in case you find something, because I haven't so far. Hey, Nocturne, can you move out of the way real quick? Alright, thanks, bud. Every day I'm pursued by these people, man. Just absolute villains, you know? Hey, where do you guys get off, huh? Attacking a weak character like me? I'm just a poor, defenseless- GET THE FUCK OUT OF MY WAY! <laughs> just a poor- defenseless guy being relentlessly attacked. You should be ashamed of yourselves. Ah, shit. Hey, watch this. Hey, asshole. Didn't expect this shit, did ya? Hey, nice ult, dumbass. Assassin characters are probably the most dangerous because they have all these gap-closing abilities, which makes it really difficult to stop them from killing you because of those gap-closing abilities they have, you know? Goddamn Lux piece of shit. Look at her. She's just sitting there, sitting out here. L look at her, look at her. She's attacking my person, my body, and she thinks she can get away with it? I'm a master of self-defense, okay? I'm a master. I'm, I, I swear to- Oh. Oh, shit. All right, this is gonna be close. I guess the winner of this battle will be decided by self-defense. Here we go. 
It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Self-defense lesson two. The defense of friends. Now picture this, you're in a scenario where you're not being attacked. Instead, your teammate, your cohort, your colleague, your friend is in danger. Now according to the rules of self-defense, I guess you can't help them out at all, right? Wrong, idiot, stupid idiot, fool, dumb idiot. Of course you can protect your friends, guys, come on. I mean, if self-defense doesn't let me defend my own friends, then what's the point? The best part about Caitlyn is that you don't even need to be there to help a friend. You can be a million miles away and still provide assistance from afar. It's so easy. So even though I'm a weak, defenseless character, I will stop at nothing to make sure that my friends don't die. Most of the time. Graves being a dickhead? I'm there, don't even worry about it, I got it. Kane fighting a swain in the jungle next to the lane? That's insane! Don't worry though, cause soon he'll be slain, cause I'm gonna shoot him right in the brain. Kane back at it again in the lane, trying to gain a kill from swain? That's inhumane! Don't worry though, because soon I'll make him feel some agony. Look at this, Cassiopeia just relentlessly attacking Nasus. You know, I just hate when people pick on people weaker than them. It disgusts me. It's a good thing that I'm here to self-defend him though. Good job, me. Holy shit, Zoe's attacking my team. She's attacking Hecarim. Don't worry, bud. I'll take care of this one. <laughs> you bitch! I had that! <sighs> it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Because what's most important is that I help protect him from danger. And not that he took a kill that I might have wanted, because I don't want kills. All I want is to defend myself and my friends, you know? This is self-defense and nothing more, alright? Uh, really, really, it's fine. I I'm already past it, okay? Just, just don't even worry about it, okay? Moving on. Moving on! Self-defense lesson three, the teleport defense. Hey, psst. Hey guys, come here. I want to show you something. Hey, you want to see why I take teleport? Check this shit out. Oh, Arr, matey, thar she be. Ezreal sitting under the tower, attacking my friends? Don't worry, mates. I'll deal with this post-haste. Self-defense, teleport, slam, die. <laughs> You're welcome. You're welcome, team. I love to help. You're welcome. <laughs> like a guardian angel, I can appear wherever I please. Just ask for my assistance, and I will be there to help. This harassment of my friends has gone on long enough, and I will stand for it no longer, for I am a self-defense master. It is my duty to protect these people from your evil ways. Get out. Leave. You've been self-defended. There's an echo down here ruthlessly attacking my teammates like crazy. I'll handle this, guys. Don't worry. I'll deal with it, okay? You're welcome. You're welcome for this. You're welcome. Caitlyn's attacking them too, man. My own character. Well, it's a good thing that I'm a professional photographer, because I always get a good shot. Hello, Tito. Check out my self-defense move. Woo! Uh, oh, uh, shit. I, I didn't get him. I mean, I don't really care, because, you know, I only care about self-defense, and, and getting kills is meaningless to me. Uh, but that being said, now that I think about it, if I had more gold, I could buy more items, which means I could self-defend people a lot better. But the quickest way to get more gold is... <gasps> self-defense lesson four, the self-defense trap. Now for this lesson, I'm gonna teach you a special self-defense technique where you just make like the 43rd president and W. Bush. You just put some traps down and then you can wait for some unsuspecting fool to walk right into their doom. <laughs> Now, to the untrained eye, I can understand how this might not seem so pacifistic. But guys, don't worry, because after convincing myself that this completely aligns with my worldview, I've realized that this completely aligns with my worldview. Look at this, watch closely. Do you see that? He stepped on my trap. He just trespassed on my property. Now, I must defend my property from danger. Oh. Man, that was a close one. Where's it gonna be? Oh, hello, Thresh. Welcome to self-defense. This is your own fault, really. I mean, you stepped on my property. Right here, any minute now. Oh, hello. Hello, sir. Hey, you know what you and a bullet have in common? You're fired. Pack your things. Get out of here. Hey, Echo, you know what's worse than one trap? Two traps? Self-defended. Oh, Zoe, be careful. You're gonna make me self-defend you, and it's not gonna be pleasant. You better be careful. With this new technique, I will be unkillable. Myself will be eternally defended from these goons, and there's nothing they can do about it. Nice try idiots welcome to self-defense all right one more here we go Talon uh, yeah oh Oh, you know what? This reminds me, actually. You see, there's this funny little thing I like to do as Caitlyn called the friendship test. It's hilarious. Let me show you. You see, basically, you just ult someone, and then you can see how good of a friend the people around them are. You see, look. <laughs> he couldn't save him. He's a shitty friend. <laughs> what? 
What, what do you mean? Oh, oh, no, 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 that, that's still self-defense, dude. I, I mean, I mean, yeah, they weren't attacking me in any capacity, but it's still pacifism. It's still self-defense. It's, uh, uh, you know what? Why don't we just move on? Yeah. Why don't we just do that? Self-defense lesson five, potential threats. Guys, this lesson is about how sometimes a threat isn't gonna immediately make itself known to you. But that doesn't mean you shouldn't take action. If you sense a threat and fear for your life, it is your duty to neutralize any potential threats in the area. Here's an example, see that guy? He hasn't hurt me yet, but he could. So all I do is I just take some preemptive action. That's allowed, that's a thing you can do. If I fear for my life, I'm allowed to kill anyone I want. That's an American fact, dude. So, now, I think it's time that I, Go neutralize some threats. Sup idiots, it's me, a pacifist, get fucked! <laughs> He's trying to run! He thinks he can escape! Oh, friendship test, oh, here we go, oh, nice try, idiot! Oh boy, I sure love getting the tower, oh, whoa, hey, what are you doing? Are you threatening me? Are you trying to intimidate me? I won't tolerate that! I don't need to see him, I can smell him, he's right in there, he's threatening me! How dare you threaten a weak and defenseless character like me, Diana? This is what you get, this is your fault! Really, Nino, walking near me in a game with me in it? Clearly you're trying to attack me! No, thank you! Standing still in a game with me in it? Really, Kane? He's definitely a threat, get him out of here! Friendship test, here we go! Oh, oh, so close, so close, man! Garen existing in my League of Legends, I will deal with this by simply saying, DANGER BE GONE! Oh, wow. Well, I wasn't aware that Harry Houdini, Master of Escapes, played League of Legends. Self-defense lesson six, bloodthirst. Now guys, you know what's dangerous? Everything. <laughs> I am no longer weak! I crave power! Give me power! All the self-defense power! Check this shit out! Net kill! Friendship test! You failed! Go back to friendship school right this instant! Give me kill! Give me dragon! Give me everything! Yes! Yes! Haha! <laughs> self-defense! 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 Woo! Wait, stop. All right, you know what? I, I do this every time. Every single guide ends with the same thing. Me screaming like a barbarian while I kill a bunch of people. I don't need to yell to kill people. No, there are much more civilized ways to torture. I mean, to defend myself from my enemies. So guys, I'd like to dedicate this next part not to screaming, but instead to friendship. To friendship and to self-defense. Now, let's go kill some people for fun. A friend. Ah, yes. Now, after defending myself from all the evil in the world, I am truly the master of self-defense. I am now the most self-defended person in the galaxy. Also, possibly the only person left. I killed everyone else. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, I hope you learned a lot about self-defense. And, uh, yeah, I hope you guys have a good- Oh, 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 oh. Oh shit, it's me, a pre-recorded message from before the events of today, wow! Guys, I'm here because yes, I wanted to plug Twitch and Discord, but actually I'm mainly here because I gotta advertise... Hell Tournament. Hell Tournament is a League of Legends tournament that I do on my Discord server. You see, if you join my Discord, you can actually join a Circle of Hell and enter for a chance to participate in our Hell Tournament. In this tournament, representatives from the Circles of Hell compete against each other in a League of Legends battle, with the whole thing being streamed and casted by Satan himself in Hell. Players are picked at random, and the winners get an MS Paint drawing drawn by me, plus a video of Satan recording himself saying anything you want, as long as it's not too long or racist. It's happening on March 14th at 3pm, and it's gonna be streamed at twitch.tv slash darkmain, so go follow me on there. Then go to the Discord server and check out the server announcements channel for details on signing up. It's gonna be real fun. Thanks for watching guys, now I'm gonna go back to being an outro screen.